the front range of Colorado is famous for upslope snow events. That's when the air slides up the slope of our state from the east and we get a layer of clouds that bring snow to a very large area. In that layer of clouds, something called snow banding can occur in the right conditions. This could happen Thursday or Friday, so let's use this setup as an example. With strong airflow from the north-northwest, a swirl called an eddy sometimes develops along the front range. This feature is known locally as the Longmont Anticyclone. It creates colliding air to the north and to the south of it, which provides additional lift for snow showers. These areas are called convergence zones in meteorology. In addition to that, stronger winds higher up in the atmosphere create even more lift by creating a kind of vacuum, which is called upper divergence. The combination of these things will often create narrow strips of very heavy snowfall. These are the snow bands. They are usually very small, sometimes less than 10 miles long and less than two miles wide, but they can bring very heavy snowfall to a small area in a short amount of time. When a small band happens to set up over a metro area, it can be wild. It happened last year on the 28th of January. A large band set up along the West Metro. Parts of Westminster got more than a foot of snow, while DIA only got one inch. Meteorologist Corey Reppenhagen, 9 News.